All right, this is a super quick tutorial on compound path and clipping mask in Illustrator. If you double click the compound path, you will see that the circle uh, creates a mask inside of the rectangle or the square, but not outside. The clipping mask is the opposite. It will create a mask outside of the square, but not inside. So how to create these two scenarios? First of all, let me tell you that you'll find them in two um, Illustrator menu object. You might not be able to see here with the screen capture, but is the menu object, which is the next one after edit. You'll see inside you have two options. One is called clipping mask and compound path, which now they are not available. You need to have two objects selected in order to activate them. So the two objects are in this instance, a square and a circle a square and a circle. The difference between these two is that the one on the left, the compound path, we have the square below the circle. You can see here from the layer structure on the top right. Uh, those on the right, the clipping mask, are the other way around. The rectangle is on top of the circle. Now, once you have this structure, you can select the two on the left and do Command A on the keyboard. Eight, like the number, yeah, number eight or it's a compound path make from the drop down menu object. Same thing on the other side here on the, on the right, you go to object and clipping mask or command seven, which is make a clipping mask. There you go, you have done it. If you want to double click, you can move around your circle here and double click and move you around your circle there. Uh, now, if you want to undo it very easy, you can go back to the same menu after selecting it and then for the compound path, we choose release, which is shift command option and eight, or you can take the one on the right and do uh, a clipping uh, mask uh, release or uh, uh, option command seven. Uh, 